What's going on, my start to finishes? Happy holidays. I hope everybody had a great Thanksgiving. I hope everybody is being safe. I hope everybody is being healthy and protecting themselves. And I just hope everybody is, is doing well. I know around these times we get real busy and it's been a very busy, 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 I would say year for me because I haven't been on here doing many uh, videos uh, for the podcasting. But um, like I said before, I do have another show and it's been taking a lot of my time. Uh, but I'm here today to make a video. Like I said, I told you before, I'm going to try to start doing more videos and dedicating more time to uh, podcasting and, and just helping you guys out. So um, today's video is going to be about making your podcast more searchable. So I get a lot of people who say, you know, I don't get enough downloads or not enough people are viewing my podcast and not a pe not enough people are listening to my podcast. And it could be part of the reason is that they can't find it. Even if you give them the name of the podcast, they may still not be able to find it because the search engine is, is brutal. OK, so if you let's just say if you and I'm just going to switch it up here. Let's just say you're looking for a guy named John Smith. OK. You type in John Smith on a Google search, you're going to get hundreds and hundreds of John Smiths, and it may not be the one that you're looking for. So those common names and those those common names make common searches. So it makes the search that much harder. So when you're dealing with your podcast, you got to make sure even when you, you name your podcast, just make sure you. You think about the name make sure it's unique that way uh it's easier to find on on searches now with searches some searches some things that you can do with with searches is just put more detailed information in in the description that's one thing that you can do um it helps a lot the more detail the more you put in there the more searchable it is all right so let's go to um something i want to talk about so when you have a podcast and you start a podcast and you submit your uh, podcast to podcasting streams, such as uh, Apple podcast, uh, they're going to ask for specific fields. OK, so one of those fields is going to be the title of your show. This is important because. This the first thing they're going to search is the title of your show, so that's that's one thing that I think it's uh, the search engines um, actually, of course it is um, put into the search. So uh, title of the show, that's a given. So you definitely want to put in the title of the show. Um, when you submit your podcast and you, and you know, everything's ready to go um, on a regular, you're going to put in the title of your podcast, the title of the episode. Um, you're going to have an author feel when you're submitting your podcast. So I'm going back and forth between submitting your podcast to a platform and just doing regular downloads. So with that said, um, when you're submitting your podcast to Apple podcasts or other platforms, they're going to even, even when you're uploading regular videos, uh, ready, regular episodes, they're going to ask you for the author, author feel most do. And that's another option. I'm going to get on that about, um, they're also going to, uh, well, I'm going to tell you not to do this. I was about to say they're also going to tell you, but do not put podcast at the end of your podcast title. Okay. So some of you have the name, the, I'll give you an example, the, the financial resource podcast. Okay. The financial resource podcast by putting podcast at the end, you just made everything you may you make it that much harder to to find your um your podcast you make it real hard for the, um, people who want to listen because with the word podcast it's such a common word like john smith so when you have podcasts and you put that at the end of your podcast and they search for the the, the uh financial resource podcast everything with podcasts in it comes is going to be part of that search. So you're going to get a hundred thousands of things way before financial resource podcast, just because you have podcasts in your title. So be careful about putting podcasts in your title of your podcast. Like try not to, 
uh, the financial resource podcast. Instead of that, you can do something like um, um, the fine talking financial resources or something like that. But don't put podcasts in it because um, your podcast may go from I'm just giving throwing a number a uh, thousand on the list with um with uh the 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 financial resource uh not without saying podcast financial resources um but if you put financial resource podcast then it's gonna go from a thousand to like ten thousand and you're gonna have like nine thousand search of the searches in front of you in front of your um your podcast so try not to put podcast uh as part of the title of your podcast if that make any sense does it make sense all right so Another thing, let's just say when you are, hmm, I'm trying to think when you, I want to, I want to, I want to, um, I want to talk about this one here, this, this three right here, the author field. So that author field is you could put your name, uh, your first and last name. You, I, I wouldn't do that. I'd put something in there relevant to your podcast. So it, it's more searchable because that's included in the search the author like most of the time these podcast platforms include the author in the search they include the title of the show the episode the author uh in this in the um search engine so as part of the search engine so um the author field let's just say your podcast is about financial resources you can put financial resources in that author page and anything related to that um financial resources like money and all of that stuff which is a common one too, but um, you can put that in there and it just makes your search a little bit more searchable too, because you're putting in stuff um, that can, that's kind of connected to your podcast and what it's about. Don't just put anything there. Don't just put your name, your first and last name, because more than likely people, when they search for your podcast, they are just going to put the title and put some stuff related to the title. You can throw your name in there, I guess, but uh, for me, I, I throw a little different, I throw different things in there that's related to start to finish podcasting, uh, like start a podcast, like start, start, uh, starting a podcast. That's okay to put there. Um, even though podcast shouldn't be in there, I'll just put start a podcast or, um, I'll put compression or all the stuff that I talk about. I put all of that inside, inside that author, um, tag right there in that field. So, it works. I, th I think it works, but you know, you may not see like your name at the top, the name of your podcast directly at the top of the, um, the search, but it definitely will be a little bit more, um, closer and more and higher ranked than if you just didn't do that. All right. So I want to show you something here. All right. So on the, I guess on your left side, you know, I'm doing this camera thing here on your left side where it says wrong. This is what I used to put in there. And this is a killer right here. You know why? Because let me tell you, um, this, the wrong one, let's look at the wrong one here. Um, start to finish podcasting, right? So I wouldn't put that there because it's just like, if all of them begin with start to finish podcasting, then people, people would have to, when they put that in, it may not show up like right at the top because start to finish podcasting could be so many different things. People be can, be can use that um, in their description. They could use it in one of their episodes. So I try to be a little bit more unique. It's better to be a little bit more unique with that first, with those first um, fields uh, in terms of um, the title. So, Another thing, episode, do not put in your title. And when, you, when you're uploading your episodes, don't put episode five or episode whatever. Episode is a very, 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 very common uh, uh, word that they uh, podcasters put in their podcast. So when you put episode, just like the word podcast, when you put episode, you're going to put a lot of podcasts in front of you, a lot of other podcasts in front of you. It has to be unique. Okay. Episode John Smith, like I said before, um, podcast, that's all common stuff and everybody uses it. 
So you got to be unique because it, like I said, if I go just put in start to finish podcasting episode, or if I just put episode such and such, it's, it's going to bring up a whole bunch of different stuff, stuff that it's definitely not going to be your podcast that's coming up in those high rankings. Okay. Now look on the, uh, the other side, the correct side, this might work. So S T F P start to finish podcasting. It's rare that somebody would use that start to finish. They are going to use that. That's kind of common. They could be like, well, start to finish. I can show you how to do this from start to finish. That'll show up in everybody's, everybody's um, search. And like in your search, uh, people, you know, a whole bunch of things just come in that where if you put start to finish in there, but if you put S T F P that's unique. Um, not too many people have S T F P which stands for start to finish podcasting. And you notice how I didn't put S T F P episode 41, keep the episode out. That's going to give you a higher ranking because if you put episode in there, a whole bunch of other things is going to come above you, uh, are going to be ranked higher than what yours is. So STFP, you put the episode number and then the title of the podcast, which that will be more searchable. So let's just say if you, let's just say I told a review of the road podcast microphone, let's say if somebody wanted to search that if they type in STFP, which is makes it that much easier to find. And then they put in zero four one and then the title, excuse me, of my episode, then it's more likely that it's going to show up in a high ranking as opposed to start to finish podcasting episode 41, a review of the road pod, mic, a, a review of the road pod, mic microphone, this one on here, the alternative, the STFP zero four one, a review of the road pod, mic microphone that's going to be more searchable and people will find it. Okay. So just remember that when, when you are uploading your episodes, try to make it unique, try to make it different from everybody else. Um, that is going to be it. I will be making more videos. I hope you enjoyed this video. I want to make sure that you, uh, have something, um, because I haven't been doing much, like I said, so I'm here, I'm trying to, you know, help you guys out a little bit and, um, I'll be back doing more videos. All right. So take care of yourself, uh, be well, and I'll see you on the next video. Thanks.